Yeah, I mean, they're, they're devastated. Um, they're heartbroken. They battled their tails off. You know, they fought to the end, quite frankly. That's all, that's all that I can ask for. Um, but I also want them to understand, too, that these games come down to about two plays, three plays, right? Um, can't give the ball away like we did late, you know, deep in our own end. We didn't tackle very well. Uh, defensively, so there's there's some things that we need to clean up and continue to clean up um, if we want to, you know, if we want to, uh, you know, get back on track. Doug Trevor leads the 87-yard drive to tie the game without the top three receivers going into today. What did he kind of show you there on being able to guide the team down, obviously down his top three receivers? You know, I think I think yeah, he 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 did a nice job. I, I give a credit to those those receivers and those tight ends, and the offensive line. That, that was, that, those guys, they they made plays for him, right? Um, now he he made some really good throws and and all of that. But um, those guys that were playing at the end of the game, when you're down your your top three receivers and and um, you know you're playing in your your 12 personnel. Uh, for the rest of the game, that's that's tough. But but the guys battled their tails off, got us back to tying this football game with a chance to you know potentially win it there late. So um, hats off for those guys. Um, Coach, can you walk us through the strategy at the end of the game? It looked like you were trying to let them score, but then they kind of fell down at the end, like not allowing you to let them. Look, score. it's it's. I mean, the only way for us to get the the ball back was to to make decisions that. You could let them score. They're going to be in church mode. I mean, it was almost inevitable. So, you know, you're playing the game and, and you're trying to do what you can to, to, you know, save time, get as much time back on that clock as you can. And, and uh, they did a great job. We'd have done the same thing. Get the first down, you go down, you know, make your opponent, in this case myself, burn your last time out, things of that nature. And, you know, um, it, uh, honestly, it was, it's smart on both sides to, to, uh, to play it that way. Doug, how serious is Christian's injury? Did it appear to be something that uh, might be? Yeah, on the on the injuries, guys. I, I don't I don't know. I haven't talked to Ferg yet. Um, you know, I, I came straight in here, so uh, I'll probably have something later and know more tomorrow. You know, when I get the updates. And with with Trevor on the fumble down there, the ability though to kind of shake it off and then kind of like you, Hayes was talking about, lead them down the rest of the way. Can you just talk about that mentality to be able to have to shake stuff off? Yeah, I mean, that's, that's our sport, right? It's that mental toughness that, that I talk about with the team. I mean, you know, you, you, we can't turn the ball over that deep. Obviously, we know that. Um, but the resilient part of that is how we battled back and, and got ourselves in position to tie the football game. And, and that's, the, that's the mindset. But that's the mindset we got to have, you know, in the first quarter. And um, that's, that'll be something that we can, we can, you know, I think learn from. Um, Moving forward. Anything else for Coach? Mike? Yeah, was there any thought to going for two at the end there? Not with all? the time remaining. If there was maybe 20 seconds or less, potentially, go for it there. But uh, with the, time, the amount of time that was left in the game and a couple timeouts, no, kick it and tie it. How, how disappointing was the defensive effort there at the end? <clears throat> you got a backup quarterback in, second and long, and giving up that big play like that? Well, I mean, that's, you know, it, it, it's disappointing that, that, you know, we were able to give up that. But I, I look at it, too. I mean, you know, we it, it shouldn't have necessarily come to that. But, um, again, it, it just goes back to what I said, too, right? I mean, you never know which two or three plays are going to be um, the ones that decide football games. And, and uh, you just got to be ready. Make the ones that come to you. and. Um, credit them, you know, they hit it and um, put them in position to win the game. All right, great coach. Thank you.